Actually, on this dashboard tour, and uh, I was in, uh, I was over at the dashboard convention, and we were in Florida, and I clearly mentioned, you know, the band and who it was, and I'm about to play a cover, and afterwards the kids just lost their mind, they were coming, like, what was that song, Where, which record's that song on, I'm like, it's on a wonderful record. <laughs> It's not mine. I, I don't know. I don't know if they knew what you ball like a baby and erase their head means, but I think they knew the part. It's like uh, you give me, you give me head. It makes it worse. Take out your retainer, put it in your purse. Too drunk to fuck. Too drunk to fuck. Rolling down the stairs. Too drunk to fuck. 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 My buddy, uh, is, uh, I met through John Snodgrass, his name's Johnny Puke, um, is, you know, not on the certificate, I don't know, it's not his real name, um, but he, he took Jello Biafra for around, uh, for a while, uh, Jello's from San Francisco, and he, he's just a dick to him the whole time, and, like, and he's getting just a, just a raging asshole, the whole time. oh my god, are you filming this? <laughs> I'm gonna have someone agree with you. Uh, but apparently, he's telling the story where he's like, he was having to take him around, and then the end, he's just like, he's at the end, he's like, if you ever give anybody my number, I'll fucking kill you. And he's walking away to the plane, he's like, if you're ever in San Francisco, call me. <laughs> like the whole time, then he turns into like, no, he was a fucking character the whole time. <laughs> call me. <laughs> um, what's happening? Um, are we up? Is there altitude here? Yeah, I didn't think so. I don't feel like I drove up. We're near the yeah, we're, we're near the lowest point in the state. Okay, yeah. I don't feel like I drove up, but I feel drunker than It's the blue moon. Oh, oh, yeah. Sir, man. Um yeah. Um so yeah, here's a happy little dance number about the worst maritime disaster in the United States history. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> So yeah, this, uh, don't feel bad if you don't know about this. It happened seven, 17 miles north where I was born and raised. I didn't know about it until about two years ago. It killed more people than the Titanic. Edmund Fitzgerald, the worst maritime disaster we ever had, and it killed more soldiers than half the battles of the Civil War. Uh, it happened right after the war was done. Uh, Booth shoots Link in the night. We shoot Booth, capture him, and shoot him. Uh, we. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we'll go America. Um, uh, so this happens that night, and the, the, the nation was just kind of desensitized by war. We heard so much shit, you know, and so it kind of just disappeared from history. So um, I don't know. Yeah, yeah. What's that? Michigan. Michigan. No, not that one. That was big. Huh? Fitzgerald was not not as big as this one. This one's a different one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Killer song, by the way. That's a good one. I love me some Gordon Light, but no, I I wrote this one. I had, I actually read books to finish this one. I said, I know. If you don't want to learn anything, you might want to take a smoke break. I swear to God, you won't learn anything else during my shows except for how to break a dude's heart with your vagina. And, and then this small piece of our missing history. <laughs> and then after that, you won't learn a damn thing. You might actually leave your dumber. Um, so I don't know why I'm doing this long intro. It's all in the song. I just read the story and I'm like, this is exactly what I say about right now. And the song will be over in a minute. And hopefully this shit will be over soon. But we just keep doing the same bullshit after it's over. Oh, I, and, uh, I just, thought you got the show and I got offended. Yeah. Oh no 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 no. The, this this. This is the song. <laughs> the same bullshit show. Now they are. This thing. Just after Appomattox, two less bullets and a barrel. For the honest and the actor, that the tragic curtain fell. There beneath the flood of headlines and the Mississippi spray, the wreck of the salt and alarms, buried to this day, buried to this day. Oh. This 
Sultana was a steamboat. She made the Nolens Cairo run. When a greedy Captain Mason heard that since the war is done and the Union POWs are free now, Uncle Sam is paying for their passage home. Five dollars every man. Well, that's four ahead. The captain said, calculating calm, about a dollar per slip to the officers to grease the Judas palm. So on a steamboat, built to carry 350 with crew, 2300 herded, a huddled multitude of purple stars and leather shadows, big tattered sticks and left of glory's human uniform, human uniform, oh. and when you figure in civilian men, women, children too, it's 500 more plus the horses, cargo, coal, and crew, and so it was, and it wasn't the numbers that night. You see the boiler needed great repair But the captain had rushed a patch job It's not to lose one precious fare And so the sea will float beneath the sleepy Memphis sky It came past a flame, a flash And death, she opened wide of the blast of the fortunate fast asleep dreams to dust the rest of war the chests of both of the thunder and the thrust and the smokestack smashed to the upper decks the screaming action fell in a splintered rain of men in flame pinned in a crush of hell and diving in the drowning men in a tangled air's roar they're frantic limbs heavy in the anesthetic cold. The dew was swollen, that's a silence. The river ate her spoils as the stony moon stared on and on. Where the gentle eye recoils to the morning sun rose warm upon lucky living through the hell and a high water mason steered them straight into now I ain't saying the captain was evil I ain't saying he's any good just wherever he stood the prophet that's where he stood and he may have stood to the flames forked over paid dearly with the river pulled down Found. That was the end of the salt town. He and the many good men as well. So for now, the end the story they couldn't count on time to tell. No deadlier than the Titanic's legendary fall. I guess it's less romantic. It's mostly soldiers after all. Been dead than at Shiloh and Chickamauga, and others lesser known. More anthems send a soldier off than ever singing home. Than ever singing home.